guys, UK Simmer here. Welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4 Part 54. So I'm just kind of getting over my cold. It has been a nightmare, a whole week full of cold, coughing, spluttering. As you guys, some of you know, I have been quite poorly recently. So I'm just getting back into recording some LPs. So I do apologise if my voice is still a little bit on the man side <laughs> so we are going to go play with our current household and um, so obviously chloe here is on her mixology table as you guys know she friggin loves this table every time that we don't do anything with the family she is here on the mixology table if you ever need to go and find where chloe is she will be on this table she is friggin annoying because she's she like makes lots and lots of drinks and just doesn't do anything with them it's so annoying but what we're gonna do is we're gonna get her to hire a service and we are gonna get a butler for the house um, because we're at that stage in the house where it is huge and we need somebody to take care of us all so I have uh, put in some Christmas stuff because it is getting to that time of year and oh my goodness so we have decorated the table we've got a new fireplace we've got the Christmas tree and everything so the Winnenberg Butlering Academy has an excellent candidate uh, to join your residence as a living butler uh, they will report for work within the day. Upon your butler's arrival, please assign them a bed to sleep in. Uh, should you be providing private quarters for your butler, you may set door locks for their section of their home. Okay, so we are going to have to go into build and buy mode. And I think... Oh, look, there's our butler. And it's a man... Oh, it's quite pretty. Um, I think what we're going to have to do is, uh, because we've got no room upstairs at all for the butler, I think we're going to have to make a basement for him. Um, I'm just trying to think where we could put the stairs. We could take out this area here and put the basement stairs down here. We could do that. Let's have a look to see what that would look like totally demolishing the house um okay so um i'm not really sure if that's gonna work let's um do a basement area and let's do it kind of we want to give him a fairly decent amount of room okay then we'll have some Stairs. We'll do these ones because I quite like them. Okay, so. Is that going to be the right space? Yes. Okay. Then we're we going to need to do a kind of fencing area. No, we need to turn that off because that's going to annoy me. And the grids, obviously, because you guys know how much they friggin' annoy me. Um. <laughs> Uh, maybe we'll do a half wall. No, that's going to be a little bit too small. We'll do a half wall like that. And then... <coughs> I'm so sorry. I've still got my cough. Which is totally annoying. Um, that seems good. And then we'll put... Maybe that like that. And then they, he can go down there to his room okay so i think this one is just going to be pretty much building our butler's house <laughs> down in the basement so let's um let's do like a hmm a hallway maybe here then he can have to be honest it doesn't need to be that big so we could do that and then he can have his bathroom perhaps here and then I am such a terrible terrible builder we could have oh my goodness what is going on um, 
the living area maybe maybe living area bedroom bathroom let's see let's put some flooring down for him we'll have some nice carpets um, I don't quite like that um, let's have a look I have so much CC it's unbelievable uh, let's get rid of these walls and then bathroom we can have some lovely tiles um, living area we could have this and then bedroom okay then wallpaper we will have for our bathroom oh did we not do the wall all the way that would probably help that would probably be a lot better why is it still doing that I have no idea um, <laughs> my game does random things see it's still doing that is that not a okay let's check this out <laughs> is that now gonna be a room there we go I have no idea I kind of did that a minute ago okay so we'll have this as the wallpaper there then why not have I don't even know what color that is but we'll have it anyway why not why the hell not um, okay so and that's going all the way across to there now okay let's <laughs> nothing ever goes right in my let's plays nothing ever um, no I don't quite like that actually Ignore that. let's have a different color for there okay cool okay so we're gonna need some doors so let's have a door for the bathroom door to the living room door to the bedroom okay cool now we just need to furnish okay so we can use our upstairs kitchen i suppose uh it's just got its own bathroom and um living area so let's give him a a bath for starters then let's give him a sink then we should give him a toilet there we go and maybe a nice little rug or mat or something something let's size this up like that yes I like that um, I want that new mirror there we go I think that looks really pretty guys I actually like that um, so maybe that's just a little bit too big um, that's miles too big okay let's just put I don't really like that oh man I just want a nice size that will do just something a little bit pretty in there okay so now let's have some lights um, in our bathroom for him Okay, that seems all right for the um, bathroom. So let's have a look at living room. So let's give him a lamp. I really, really like um, the one that come with the vintage stuff. I like it. And then we could give him some, let's actually filter by the vintage stuff. Um, and let's give him a nice um, do you think he's 
going to be a person that watches TV. So I kind of have a feeling the door's there, which is going to be quite annoying. Uh, oh no, this was going to be the living room, wasn't it? Oh, now that's going to be annoying. Okay, that's going to be the bedroom now then. <laughs> I can't decide! Okay, so we're going to have the... No, I don't like it like that. Okay, I'm going to move that door to there. And then I'm going to put the lamp there. And then he's going to have a nice TV. I'm not going to give him one too big. It's not going to be that glamorous. Um. Okay, then... Hmm. Okay, we need to go back into the... Because that's the one that I want. I can never remember <laughs> what um, they... Um, what come with what pack. Okay, that kind of looks pretty scary. Okay, and we did we get... We did get rugs. Okay, cool. I like that. Um, we perhaps need... Oh man, why won't they go on the table? Let's put that like that. There we go. Nice and basic. Okay, now bedroom. He could have... Um, let's have a look. I quite like that bed. Okay, I'm going to have to move that door there. I'm going to move that up a little bit. And why the hell did that not paint those two bits of the wall? I do not know. Okay, so we're going to put the, his bed kind of in the middle of the room. Kind of. Uh, <laughs> and then oh, we need to go back into vintage. So we can have a nice table. Did we get any mirrors? We did. I'll have that one there. Uh, he's not going to need a vanity table. He is going to need some bedside tables though. And uh, did we get any paintings? We did. But they're all like not grand stuff. So we have two of them, and then we could have that there. And I think that will pretty much do, actually. It's a basic room. Um, but yeah, this can be the butler's. So we are going to assign bed to butler. Um, and then... Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to go... Uh, lock door for everyone but butler, lock door for everyone but butler, and lock door for everyone but butler. So we can actually come down here, but we can't go into the butler's um, sort of living quarters, uh, which is friggin' awesome. So why not... Um, where are you going? Oh, you're going to attend our garden. Okay, actually, what I want you to do is I want you to uh, cook a family meal for us. Even though Chloe actually really, really likes to cook because she is a chef, she actually wants to have a night off, so she wants um, him to come and cook them a meal. So we're going to get uh, the twins to do that extra credit as well um, get that done so here is the butler he is now cooking us a family meal Chloe what are you doing of course as always on that blooming mixology table uh, who would have guessed hey guys who would have guessed <coughs> oh my goodness this butler's good um, I take it we're going to need to sort of get to know him um, to find out, you know, 
what his traits are and things like that. Oh, he wasn't such a good cook then. He got his knife stuck in the chopping board. Which is quite funny. <laughs> okay, so. Really want him to hurry up and cook. Oh, so he didn't do any like anything fancy. It was just like BLT sandwiches. It's a great meal, Butler. I like how they just stand there. I like how butlers do. Not that I know what a butler does, but you know, you see it on films and you see it like on the Queens when the, she does all the palace stuff and that and that's how they, they stand. So we're calling everybody to meal, so hopefully uh, everybody will come and join us for BLT sandwiches, which is not very great for our um, our meal. And he's going to come and check baby. Peter was actually sleeping there, Butler. What, are you na what is your name? Oh my goodness, we're going to have to change your name because there is no way I'm pronouncing that name. <laughs> Typical. It's always, it's always happens. Always get a sim I can never re like pronounce their names. So guys, we have now got a butler in the Chloe and Carlo um, residence. So that is friggin' awesome. <coughs> oh my goodness. So before my voice totally does go again, um, I am going to end this part here, guys. So we've now got a butler in the household. We've now built, built, oh my goodness, we've now built him uh, his own little quarters to live in. Um, so let's have some fun with the butler. What uh, what will the butler be able to do um, and things like that. So let's see how the story unfolds there. But welcome to the butler in the Chloe and Carlo household. So if you have enjoyed this part, I know it's just pretty much about the build and stuff, but uh, we'll get more into gameplay next time. So if you have liked this part, then do give me that big thumbs up. Um, as always, please do like, subscribe and comment, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.